Hey guys, in the shed with Red here, I'm gonna do something I normally don't talk about, and that is guns. And the reason why is because this is a 410 um, Stevens Model 301, very popular gun. Bought this for like 225 bucks with the red dot at our local gun store for turkey season for my son to use. It is a very lightweight, uh, user-friendly gun for first-timer shooting shotguns, turkey hunting, which is what we do with it. Uh, in the process of walking around the woods one day, suddenly his sling came off and it's literally the pin itself fell out. Whenever it did, he had to carry the gun the rest of the day. Now this is lightweight, wasn't a big deal, but that's not why, or that's not the way it's supposed to be made. So ultimately we came home, we were going out the next morning. I didn't have much time to fool with it and I just literally threw some zip ties around it to hold it on so he could use the pin appropriately and what i found is that whenever i pulled this off this gun is made to break open and so i've already cut the zip ties it has a button that you push and you can actually break this gun down which is awesome and we'll pull this out and on the inside there is a lever slide and you're not going to be able to see it in this video but ultimately in this area right here it has a pin it catches this pin and it's actually what holds the gun together otherwise you can break this gun down and i'll show you real quick it's just that simple there you go you got your barrel and you got your stock and it goes back together just as simple there you go and ultimately you could shoot this thing like that if you want but you wouldn't have a hand rest a front rest um, as you need it so the problem was was that the bolt on the inside of the sleeve had come out so I ended up flipping or putting this back in and whenever I did I could not get it to latch back on appropriately now I didn't have time to mess with it much more so we threw the um, truly the redneck zip tie straps on it and went with it and so turkey season's over messing around on a rainy day and I figured out my problem Guys, so here we go. We have pulled um, the front off, and this is the piece that you will have on the inside. So this sets essentially it slides in. You have a this piece here that you will push on to release the actual barrel from the rifle, and it slides in here now my mistake originally whenever i put this back together was on this portion here i may be able to show you but it is slightly slanted and i put this piece in upside down and on the back side it is not it is flat and so you need this the part that slides so it actually will clip in so we're actually going to put that bottom down slide it in maybe see and we will pass her through ultimately I gotta get it all the way through and into the back there we go and so you'll see whenever I push this button um, a hole will appear right right here boom 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 and that hole is actually where the sling clip ties in so i have the sling clip here and we're going to go ahead and put it in now all right so we got that on the sling clip is in and then i'm just going to use the bolt and tighten down it's a little small nine what was it nine thirty seconds who actually uses a 930 second bolt. I don't know, it's not a quarter inch, it's a nine. All right, as you can see, we fixed the stock, the guns in three pieces right now, and that's essentially what it will break down to. Great if you were doing like some backpacking, uh, something like that. This is super easy gun to carry if you didn't need much from a fire load. Um, we're simply gonna pop it back together. And she's there, and now, all you do is you press this clip in, slide your sleeve in, 
and boom, she clicked back in and now she is ready to go. I have my sling bolt back in appropriately and she's ready to hunt. So there it is, Stevens 301. One little problem that I've ran into it and truly the only problem I've ran into with it. Great little gun, um, especially for younger people. My eight year old, which who weighs uh, 52 pounds, I think. Um, he can smoke a target with it. He hasn't shot an actual bird yet, but he can smoke a target with it comfortably with it on a stand. So, uh, great gun. Check it out. Um, if you see any other problems like that with yours, just let me know. We'll go from there. Hey, thanks for watching In the Shed with Red. Short disclaimer, uh, this is a great gun. I am not a terribly big gun guy. I have several, um, but when it gets to details on them i usually ask my friends they're much more in tune with the ways of the world from rifles go uh, rifles or shotguns so um, by no means am i a repairman of any sort for the gun work or, or a gun guru from that aspect so uh, you're on your own if you take my advice but mine was a simple handle fix i wasn't doing anything with the actual pin or the load so um Thanks for watching In the Shed with Red. Enjoy the shotgun.